in Canada, we don't have the visuals of the loss. You go over to Europe, you throw a stone and you hit a, a major military graveyard. And you're immediately reminded of what happens. You dig up uh, artifacts and explosives. It's, it's continuous. And we are here in Canada are so lucky that we don't have anything like that. And so when you walk up there and it's a tomb of the unknown soldier, it represents every soldier that has in, lost their lives in the service of Canada. So for veterans across the country, it's a huge symbol of one of their comrades had been brought back from a far off battlefield. It was important that it was done. The Legion, the Royal Canadian Legion, was the one that planted the seed. You can walk up to any piece of granite with something writing on the on the wall. You can walk into a graveyard uh, where and you see a tombstone, and if nobody's there, it's not the same. But the moment that there is a body underneath that particular uh, tombstone or your cenotaph, then it's a human thing. If there's a human connection. When the end of the ceremony happens, what happens is, and I, it, it, it just happened, the people started placing their poppies on top of the tomb of an unknown soldier. So it symbolized, you know, here's my poppy, and here's my memory, and here's my gratitude. Uh, that's why there's a focal point. It's not, a, it's not the granite and the statues that are sitting behind it. It's the actual grave site. That's proof positive that Canada needed a symbol like this. There's the one saying, those that forget are doomed to repeat. This is, yes, we're looking at the sacrifices made, the immense loss, and the main purpose for Remembrance Day is pay attention. Look at the loss that's happened. This should not be repeated ever.